Hey everybody, welcome back to A Slice of Gaming. I'm the only Pi 3 and 4. This is Mario's Time Machine for the Super Nintendo, and this game is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. So I've got my first item on the last floor. I've only got five more to go for items anyways to give away. I thought it was six, but I guess it's five. Let's find a little bit more about what this thing is. I know what it is because I learned about it in school. Mains, 1455. When a young Johann Gutenberg was growing up in Germany, at the turn of the 15th century, books were very rare and expensive because of a scribe had to duplicate each copy by hand. Ugh, lots of work. Since Johann was a child of great curiosity who loved to read, he dreamt of a faster, easier way to make books. Luckily, Johann had inherited a large fortune. This allowed him to dedicate all his time to the invention that would soon change the world. The secret, he realized, was in finding a way to print words so copies could be quick and effortless. Next page. Gutenberg first tried carving letters from wood, but the printing came out crooked and blurry. He continued to experiment, spending all of his father's money during the 30 years it took to perfect the perfect printing press. Fin the final press was made with movable metal type, also called slugs, worked perfectly. His childhood dream realized at last. Johann printed his first books in 1455. They are known today as Gutenberg Bibles. Ooh, the mention of the Bible! Oh no! And as usual, I did the time machine beforehand, so we don't all gonna have to screw around. We've got five, four, I guess, items to go. Let's hurry up and finish this off. Bowser's got nothing on us. We're returning all those items and he's not doing anything about it going on, man? Sp Bowser, come on, put up at least a bit of a fight. Where are your Koopa kids? At least in Mario's time machine, we had to fight the Koopa kids. Sure, we didn't take damage from them, but come on, this is Mario. This is Mario we're talking about here. At least send out something. Some cavalry. Come on. Lazy. Someone is lazy. Bowser, you sure let yourself go recently. Tis a shame. A shame. First you're stealing items from the past when you could just destroy Mario. Now you're not even doing anything about it now that we're in your castle. I'm sure he's noticed by now that like 10 of his shit that he stole is actually missing. Anyways, who cares? We're in Germany! Germany! So let's get started. Let's go in here. Hello, is this letter yours? Shh, son, this is a library. I have absolutely no excuse for what appears to be a metal letter or a, wet, or a wax seal. Perhaps the fellow at the mint might have made that. Does Air Gutenberg have a library card? What? Gutenberg used to come here every day when he was a little boy. What a bookworm that kid was. Most families can't afford to have a single book in their home. Does Gutenberg come here anymore? Nah, no, he's been too busy trying to invent a faster, cheaper way to make books in large quantities. I hear he does... That's all he does anymore. Could this middle letter help him? Well, you don't have to be a librarian to know that every book is filled with letters. But enough talk. Try some of this tea. I grew myself in the cathedral garden out back. Can you tell me about this letter G? It's a G. I thought it was an E backwards, but I guess it's a G the other way around. Do I have to spell it out for you, Mario? I can't talk anymore. Our books are all so valuable that I have many locks on them. Now I've lost the key to the mayor's favorite book. I must find it. Mm, screw you then. Let's see, where could this man be? Could he be here? Hi, this is some place. What do you do here? This is a very important mint, and I am a very important craftsman. I use silver, gold, and lead to make keys, coins, medals, and other important things. Do you make this letter G I have here? That's not my work. Johann Gutenberg made that. I think he... He thinks he's the only person in Mainz, despite jewelers, that knows anything about metal crafting. Does Gutenberg here work, work here with you? He thinks he's too important to work here. If he hasn't inherited that fortune from his father, things would have been different. He spent the whole pile of buying expensive metals for a secret project. What's the secret project? You can tell me! Ha! Huh, wouldn't you like to know? I'll give you this key, however. It's an example of superior metalworking. Now it's lunchtime. I can't talk when I'm hungry. Okay. To the scribe. Hi, what are you doing? It's not hard to describe what a scribe does. Plumber, I sit on my table and copy books word for word. Now excuse my yawning, I get so sleepy. Do you like your work, scribe? 
I love books, but as a career, there's nothing to write home about. Copying manuscripts is hard work. It takes forever. No wonder these books are so darn expensive. Will this metal letter G help? If it was... If that were used to print letters, it would make 50 G's in a minute. Where it would take me hours. Then I'd have some more time to eat my wife's cooking. Have a drumstick. Well, I have Gutenberg's invention works out. Me too. If I have to copy one more book... Oh well, they say that only good writing is rewriting and rewriting and oh dear, I'm going to head a ladder to sneak that ink. Need a ladder to sink, reach that ink and on the closest shelf. Ugh, so Gutenberg must be in here. There you are. Hi, Johan. Having a productive type of day? Yes, it is Air Gutenberg to you. Please be on your way now, diminutive one. I'm pressed for time. I must follow my schedule to the letter or this printing press will never be finished. Er Gutenberg, I believe this is your time. Oh look, things are blowing now, yay! You're my type of guy, Mario, but please call me Johan. Your hard work has helped me to finish my masterpiece. What will you do next, Johan? Well, Mario, after spending the last 30 years working day and night on this printing press, I've got a stack of reading to catch up on. Uh, so I have no items. This is probably another glitchy part in the game. Hi, do you recognize this metal letter G? Hmm, uh, I work with animal skins making parchments. Those sharp lines will make a big impression on my products, though. Why not ask the scribe next door? The next next door. His business is letters, after all. Sound interesting, but what's a parchment? I'm glad you asked. It's goats or sheepskin that's been carefully crafted to be soft, clean, and thin enough to write on. The stock we make here is very good and very expensive. Do you know anything about Air Gutenberg? I'm quite impressed by your curiosity. Actually, I know quite a bit about him, but I really don't care. I really can't chat unless it's over a nice hot cup of tea. Okay, usually I'd have items here to give away, but once again, this game kind of fucked up. Let's try talking to him again. Or him again. See if I get anything. Because I have items. Oh. Oh, there we go. I had to ask about things. Here, have a ladder. Just what I needed. Now I can reach the gold ink in my master's closet. Gutenberg wants to use it in his first book, the Bible. Can you tell me anything else about Gutenberg? I'm no font of wisdom, but if you don't get that medal to Air Gutenberg right away, we'll have to read un Gutenberg's Bibles. Okay. To you now. Tea bag. Hmm, Cathedral Tea. My absolute favorite. Thanks, uh, Mario. Now what are you saying about Joan? What's his so-called secret project? Secret? Ha! Huh. Everyone in Germany knows he's been working on a prison printing press for at least 30 years. That's a long time. Is he finished? Well, uh, if he doesn't pay back the money he borrowed, he may throw the book at him. But he swore he'd print the Bible this year. And Gutenberg always keeps his word. Uh, okay. To you now. Have a key. A spare key! You found it! Oh, I could kiss you! Oh my god, I'm sorry! This is a library, I shouldn't tell. Now, there's some book in particular you wanted to see. I'd like to know more about Gutenberg. Oh, yes, poor man. He ran out of money while working on his first book, the Bible. If he can't pay his loans back, they may make a man over his invention. Gee, will he get credit for the press? Everyone in Maine knows that Gutenberg's Bible. Perhaps he should write a book about his life and bridge it up. Then the whole world would know. Okay. To you! Over here, Mr. Hungry Man. What's the secret project? Mmm, toasted chicken. I was going to have a hamburger in Frankfurt for lunch, but they didn't show up. It, what? 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 What's so funny? Oh, I suppose you want to know more about Air Gutenberg. Why did Joan use metal for his letter? Oh, he tried wood first, but any fool knows that wood is too soft. The letters come out crooked and blurry. But Gutenberg kept on trying, and he used to work here, you know. Alright, we are pretty much done here. After I solved the mystery as to why things weren't working out for me. Whee! Going back to return the next item. I got some fucking music going on here. And we're going to return this uh, circle thing when I come back. So, catch you guys later. See ya.